know if you can hear me, but I've been walking from the airport for the last couple, I don't know, it must have been like four miles I've been going. I'm just, it's raining like hell. Uh, I don't know if I can do this on foot. Detroit is huge. Um, I've got a lot of people that have offered to help me, and I'm going to call somebody right now to just pick me up. This is, I can't, I can't do this man versus wild concept. I'm going to have to change my plans. I'm right here at the Uniroyal sign or whatever. I don't know. But anyways, it's just it's too ridiculous. I've been walking along the freeway, uh, and I haven't gotten in trouble yet. I, I'm, there's someone I've been talking with on YouTube. I don't know him personally, but he said he would pick me up and help me. So I'm going to give the guy a call and see if he'll come pick me up right now. Hey, buddy, yeah. Hey, can you come pick me up? Okay, cool, cool. Awesome. Here he is. This is him. Looks like it's him. How's it going, man? Yeah, thanks, man. Appreciate you picking me up, bro. I'm all wet here. I'm here with, uh, they want to remain anonymous, but I'm with a group of guys that actually picked me up. I've met them through YouTube. We've been kind of going back and forth. Um, Ex-military guys. Um, and we're just driving around Detroit right now. They'd like to remain anonymous, but they're, they're trustworthy dudes. I mean what I can tell. So hey guys, what my my local guys here that are telling me is in the city of Detroit, forty to fifty percent of the people are actually working for the city and the rest of them are on some type of welfare or uh, you know uh, programs with the government and the city council is really some of the major people at fault. This is just a system that reinforces failure here in, uh, you know, Metro Detroit, I believe. But it's really been helpful, these uh, anonymous guys that are taking me around and really helping me uh, show me different yeah, areas. work for an entity of the government. I don't want to say what, who our checks are written by, but... No, it's, it's okay. You don't have to tell me. I'm just... Uh, just real interesting, you know. You're not gonna get my face on there, right? Eh? No, no, nothing, 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 nothing. Okay, all right. Where are we getting ready? Where are we going? No, we're getting ready. To head down eight mile. Hey guys, we're in front of Cooley High. We're getting ready to go into the depths of Detroit. Some really bad areas. I've already seen some bad areas, but the guys that I'm rolling with are telling me it gets even worse than this and gets way more dangerous. So. I'm going to do the best I can to be as safe as I can, but I really want to get in there and get deep into the get some footage for you guys. This is uh, Cooley High. Uh, this is a school that is, uh, I believe it's open right now, but from what I'm hearing, there were 50 schools here in the Detroit area that were slated to be closed down, uh, shut down. Uh, and now that's about 23 or 25 schools. So as you can see here in Detroit, Schools are closing down. They're becoming like ghost towns. Yeah, there's no bulk trash there. They get it twice a year. It was once a month under the old man, two years ago. Keep going. George, we're now starting to enter into the deep uh, parts of Metro Detroit, it's getting really hairy around here. But this I noticed was a building that's vacant. Um, I, I don't know if people are, are living in here, but uh, it, could, it could be pretty dangerous. Uh, there could be uh, people on drugs in here. Uh, who knows? But we're going to check it out and see what's inside. So come on. 
keep them over here. Looks like, uh, hey, is anybody in here? Hello? Looks like they got a ladder here. Let's just try to... Hey, is someone in there? That's how they get down here. They come down this uh, ladder like this, and they... Uh, and everything around here. You gotta be real careful, it can slice you open. Here, we'll get the camera here and take a look. I'm down here, really dark, scary here. Anything could be down here. We don't know what I'm gonna find, but uh, we'll take a look down here, guys. Oh yeah. We got some type of trash here over here, guys. And I don't know what I'm gonna find in here. Looks like someone could have been killed in here. So this is the type of thing where you might find a dead body in here somewhere around the corner. I don't know. Pretty damn scary, if you ask me. Up here is a stairway, and I definitely don't want to go up here. We're gonna see what we have up here. 